Well, my new torch seems to be working really good. Works brass really nice. I might not be the best uh, welder, but it's doing the job. I mean, that's a pretty thick piece of steel there, and that's pretty thin pipe. So, it's not blowing through it, but the brass is flowing. Looks like it's sticking pretty good. I think we got this all figured out. That's pretty cool. Okay, I did want to show you this flame. Ain't that a pretty flame? That's what I've been using here. And, uh, yeah, it takes a little skill to not melt the can. <laughs> but, well, it's not hard at all. This works really nice. Nice to have unlimited oxygen. Alright, just thought I'd show you the nice flame on that brazen tip. Okay, this is a request <laughs> to see if this thing will cut. Now this is just over a quarter inch, 0.265 inches and I'm going to try to heat this up and make it go. This might do. Okay, so that was ice cold. Let's see what happens. See if I can get it red. Hot. So I don't know where to set this thing yet. I'll try that. Come on, you can do it. Wouldn't say it cuts cleanly or at all. <laughs> Getting blowback now. Don't let my dad see this. Nope. Oh, yeah. There you go. Kinda. Kinda. Cut this real easy. So it might do uh, one eighth. It does function. I'd never use it like that. 
putt, it does heat up the metal nicely. Um, and therefore, I could use it for bending. It's already red. Yeah. I'd use it for bending. If nothing else. Well, we're probably at its limits. That was it. It's an experiment.